Step one is mixing our primary colors to make secondary. We're going to need our ladybug template, our watercolors, our cup of water, a paintbrush, and a paper towel. So we're only going to be using three colors of our paint today. I labeled my ladybug template so that you could see it. Um, and just know what colors I'm mixing, but you do not have to label it. And I'm showing you now what colors we're using. So the clear tray um, lid is furthest from you, and you are using the paints closest to you. So the red, yellow, and blue. So first we're going to mix red and yellow to make orange. We are going to use the clear, um, the clear lid to mix our colors and you want to dip your paintbrush in the water before you start and then start to get some red on your brush and while you have red on your brush you can color in the first red wing where um, it says red on my paper I forgot to do it first but while you have the red on your brush color in that red wing and then we're going to go ahead and put some of that red on our clear lid. That's going to be our mixing tray. So then clean your brush completely after you're done with the red. Get as much as I have onto your palette. And then use your brush to dip it into the yellow. And you want to make sure that your brush was completely cleaned. So get all the red out of it, clean it off on your paper towel, and then dip into your yellow. And you want to get some onto the palette, but not mix it with the red yet, because we want to make sure we have enough yellow so that we can make orange. So once you think you have enough, quite a bit of yellow, you want to have like the same amount of yellow and red, then begin mixing them together. And then color in your body of your ladybug. So our wings of our ladybug are the primary colors and the bodies of the ladybugs are the secondary colors. So like I said before, I would fill in the wings first, which I'm going to do on the next two, um, but I forgot to do that first. I started mixing before I did that. So fill in your wings first with the red and when you clean your brush to get your yellow, use your yellow to um, paint in your wing, and then mix your colors. Notice that I am cleaning my brush on my paper towel to make sure that there's not any more red paint left before I dip it into the yellow. So finish that one up, and then we're going to move on to mixing green. So next, we're going to mix our colors the exact same way that we just did, but we're going to be making green this time. So we're going to be using blue and yellow. So notice that I'm painting in my wing first, which I should have done for my red one. So painted that in and then used my blue to put some on my palette. And notice that the clear lid we're using as our mixing tray um, is separated into three parts. So use one for your orange, use one for your green, and then we'll use one for our purple. So there you go, mixing green. And then next we're going to move on to the red and blue to make purple. So got some red on my brush, used it to paint in my wing. Then I'm going to get some more red. I meant to put it in that last tray. Um, notice that I'm about to clean it off because um, let's use all three different trays to separate our colors so they don't mix together. So got some red, clean your brush, make sure that you have no more red in it. And now use some blue to get some onto your palette. 
I'm gonna mix those two together to make purple. So clean your brush off when you're done. Red and yellow make orange, blue and yellow make green, red and blue make purple, um, and you can totally color in the heads of the ladybugs if you want. I decided not to.